Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf, your one and only. Now, here I'm going to be playing another mobile game, and this one is Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Link. Now, this did recently just hit um, Google Play, which is why so many people were so hyped about it. They said it was quite different from the other Yu-Gi-Oh! games that have been made, which I'm kind of interested to see. Seems like they have a little mini update. So, the only reason I was interested to see this is because I... I did like Yu-Gi-Oh! for quite a while. Used to play the card game, so I know a few things about it. So it looks like they do have, like, actual dialogue and everything. So, as you guys can see, it's you cannot play the game, like, sideways. You gotta play it straight up. So, vertical. So that actually... Eh. I don't know how to feel about that. Cannot afford to lose. Oh, they actually have voice acting. I did not hear that. Uh, so who do we want to go with, Kaiba or Yugi? I always like Kaiba, but let's go with Kaiba. I like the blue eyes. Why not? Now, I'm not really an expert on a whole Yu-Gi-Oh scene, though. I played a few of the games, beaten a few of them, but. But yeah, I'm I'm a bit of an average player. You will not defeat me, Yugi. But seriously, with the way it looks right now, you would. Yeah, see, that's the unique, different thing about it. They actually have like somewhat of a. All right, this is actually is pretty different. I see what people are saying. But like I was saying, it would probably be a lot better if it was sideways. Maybe I can change it. Normal summon. I wonder if we still have our normal phases. That's a little bit different for a mobile game. Not not bad, if anything. Really? We all need to know that, Kaiba. Come on, Yugi. You're a main character, man. You always win. Alright, it seems like they're... Get ready. Did we go through our uh, normal phases we go through? Draw. This is really weird right now. Yeah, I know about that. Tributes. I don't remember a whole bunch of the um, cards, though. But I remember a few of them. I remember the sheep. Oh, that used to be a token, wasn't it? Alright, so they actually have, like, card animations. That's actually pretty dope. Wish all the cards at least had, a, like, a 3D version. I'm really hoping they actually do that for a VR game. Because if they actually did, do do that, I would actually go for it. I know the whole Duelist thing just came out and everybody's on that. But that's on Steam. I don't really have it, so. <laughs> Rip, man. Rip, Yuki. You tried. In this game, you don't win. Kaiba was always so weird to me. He was, like, totally obsessed with Yuyi. <laughs> I think I stopped watching the the anime after like, huh? I guess after GX I start I stopped watching it. But as you guys can see, the game's actually pretty decent. Except. It's so weird that we can do that. This is gonna be me through my whole turns. I mean, what? Stop. It's gonna be literally addicting to do now. Alright, that's some pretty unique uh, animations to it.
Yeah, why don't you guys do that for the actual VRs, man? Alright, who's this guy? Alright. Poor Link Raider has shown up. Is, is, so is this guy like a fanboy or something? Or are we actually gonna duel him? Oh, you could actually duel him. This could be interesting. So you can... I guess there is like a... Um, like an adventure mode where you can actually duel people. That's gonna be quite fun. I wonder how the PvP goes. There can only be one winner. And you're looking at him. Losing's never in the cards for me. You're looking at the future champion of the world. Sure, Josh. Sure. Alright, so use spells and traps. So they have a few objectives. I remember that card. The only thing that throws me off right now is do we get to actually use like um, our own decks or is it just gonna be like this? I really hope not. Go ahead and set them down. Alright, so, pretty much when he attacks him, he's gonna go up, then I just automatically kill him. Yeah, go ahead and attack him. I dare ya. Well, no, I'm sorry Josh, this is, this is where you die. This is where you lose, man. Always believe in the heart of the cards. Bye. Amateur. Amateur mistakes. <laughs> Can't really say amateur mistakes when I make bad BMs inside of these games. <laughs> ah, it seems like you do unlock cards and you have a few gems. I guess that's for like opening packs and everything. This should be fun and interesting. I'll explain your stage, okay. So it seems like we have a few more missions to go through before we can actually start doing all this. You just cleared a mission, claim your reward. Alright. Stage 2! Or your mission complete, move to stage 2. At your stage upgrades, characters. Oh, okay, so we can change our characters, okay. that's. Okay, that's weird. That is so weird. You have to actually slide to go to different places. Alright, so... Ultra Rising. So we can actually buy packs now. So do these just tell me what, what are inside of here, or... What? I'm clicking on them, trying to move them, but apparently I cannot see what's inside of the packs. Let's purchase. Oh, Karibo. Let me guess, I just rip off the top. No? Aw, I always miss ripping off the top of them. Alright. Turtle Oaf. Summon Crab Turtle. Let's see. Hmm. A lot of ritual cards related. Well, a lot of later ritual cards. Most attribute for a ritual summon has returned to owner's deck instead of being sent to the graveyard. Okay, that's actually pretty handy. Send one card from your hand to your graveyard. Equip this card to a monster. It loses 500 attack. But it makes a second attack during each battle phase. Okay, so that's pretty much like a two hitter. Is that all I get, really? What a lame pack opening. You would think you would just get like 10 or at least. Or the number amount in an actual pack. 
but all right, thanks, game. <laughs> Must have realized by now you've arrived. At the... uh, yep, I realized that. It's the perfect place to man who's the real champion. Well, I determined I am the real champion. Who will be the one? Who will rule over all? Who will be the next? Well, ah, oh, words are hard. <laughs> Who will wear the crown as the... Nah, you know what? I, I can already say that I am the next person who's going to wear the crown. It's not being cocky. It's just true. Watch. I'm going to fail so hard as I just say all this crap. <laughs> Alright. Each battle ever duel a fight is kind of closer to comp uh, competing in this world. As for you, Yugi, we have our final battle in this world. You were obsessed with that blue eyes. Yugi was assessed with Dark Magician anyway, so can't really say he was the only one. Alright, so. Alright, that's just like notifications, updates, and everything. Logged in. Dual Orb. What is Dual Orbs? Are they just basically pack openers? We found some gate keys. Don't know what these gate keys are. We unlock Kaiba. You know, like some more gems. Another key. Now we just went up to level 3. That was pretty quick. Okay. <laughs> what is in thou gate? So it seems like this is a um, actual chat. Okay, chat looks just looks weird. I could have designed that a little bit better. Linking to Joey Wheeler. I haven't heard, I haven't seen Joey in so long. The nostalgia of this dude. No, I haven't seen him since the original Yu-Gi-Oh. I just noticed that. Uh, no, you, you always just crash parties, man. Of course he didn't send you an invite. It's appeared. Uh, can we actually just go fight him? Alright, so... A device that allows you to access direct challenges with legendary duelists. So that's just going to mean you can pretty much just battle with uh, main characters that you've seen in the actual animation or well, anime. All right, select so the duelist you want to challenge, then use the key, and then as your stage increases, you'll um, earn more reward depending on which. Which level of the duelist is on? To be high duelist, to acquire better duel rewards. All right, let's go beat Joey. See how this goes. Can we actually go in with a deck now? All right, he's level ten. We should be okay, right? Right? See if you can't get to this. Sage, unless you beat me. Come on, show me what you got. You would think voice acting would be through the whole game. Apparently not. Guess they just did a little special thing for you guys just to, you know, say ooh, ah at the beginning. Then just take it out through most of the dialogue. <laughs> most mobile games don't really have all that many voice acting anyway, so... I can't really say much. I'm going second. Bite me, Joey. I'll show this sniveling puppy 
that he's more bark than bite. Ow. It's time I put your stinking mug in its place. Duel. Joey he always talks so much smack, right. but both of the duels he would I lose. Oh, hello there. Ah, you're my third. I just love his accent too. You got another one of those? Come on, man. Oh, uh, let's see if I can... <laughs> let's see if I still got it. So this is an effect card. I think you're... It would say effect if it was the actual effect card, right? Alright, let's see what we have here. Decrease your opponent's life points by 300. Uh, select one face-up attack monster on your opponent's side and change it to defense. Okay, I can easily do that. But I don't think I can attack this turn, so I'm just going to summon this. Let's go ahead and deal some damage. I activate a spell. Alright, so we can get an overview and everything too. Just bothers me that it's vertical. Why does that bother me so much? Alright, battle phase. So I can. Let's just go ahead and use this. Go ahead and go into defense, buddy. Get that out of my face. With a you didn't need that. I end my turn. Here I go. I draw. What are you gonna do now, Joey? I summon a monster and attack. I end my turn. Here I go. Alright, at least they have voice Take acting inside the actual duel. Draw. I, I used to have that card. What? <laughs> Oh, hold on. Uh, what am I going to do with next round? Let's just go to battle. Watch and learn. I attack with a monster. Get rid of him. There's no way this is Joey's actual deck. Some of these cards I don't remember. Maybe it is his original deck. Well, some of his cards. I don't think got any effect cards. I don't think this even rise with effect cards then. I summon a monster in attack position. Uh, if you guys have um ever heard of the what was it? The level up cards, like Armor Dragon level up. I used to use those cards like mostly. I always love the level up decks because they're just so unique and fun. Yeah, another one's gonna do it too. So bad that I can actually drag my whole screen. Please stay, stay, stay back where it is. Or you can go back here and look at the little pop-ups. You know, next round you're dead. Better be careful. Who are you changing to defense? That was not smart, but okay. Oh, I guess you're gonna attack, aren't you? That's fine by me. That's fine, that's fine. Yeah, harder the cards, man. Wasn't much harder than the cards if I drew another one of those. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and... Uh, I could have skipped to battle phase, or I can just kind of do this. I summon a monster in attack position. Just overkill. Come on, Joey, man. Don't let me perfect you right now. You got something in there. No? Up. Oh, well. GG, fam. You almost had it. You almost had it, Joey. Not really, but you almost had it. Alright, I'm actually liking this game so far. Hopefully, um... 
never hear the end of this. Yeah, you, you kind of want Joey Wheeler is no cause for celebration. <laughs> I could have beaten him blindfolded. Well, well, damn, get <laughs> to keep Kaiba chill. <laughs> But uh, I'm hoping Hollow actually can get this game working because he he was the one who actually showed me this game. And I would love to battle him. You just have like a actual recording of us battling each other. Alright, who's this guy? Alright, he's a 5 star. This is also a 5 star. They're pretty okay standards. What else is there? Yeah, you and Yugi both, so you guys can go ahead and step off that, you know, little adventure train. In my opinion, Joey probably was the weakest duelist at the time. At the time, he started to get a little bit better. So now I can play as Joey now. New characters are available as you use. Well, available to use as you um, advance. So I can unlock all these people. Wait, where's Bay? Um, where's Blondie? Can't remember her name though. God, it's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't remember her name. We all know who I'm talking about, right? Um, the Ob Obelisk Blue, like dorm girl, whatever her name was. Let's see, can I open some more packs? Oh, I remember this card. Um, God, I can't remember the name though. Yeah, that. But I had the other one of him. I can't remember the other one's name though. One I had was like Aqua something. I could buy one of those packs, but I'm not going to. Uh, Meteor Dragon. Pretty sure that's what it was. Oh, you can't actually look at those. I believe that's Meteor Dragon. Because I used to have him. He was like a purple. Yeah, Mete Meteor B Dragon. Yeah, it was a fusion card. I thought so. Alright, yep, I remember this dude. I remember this one. This is the old card pack I used to um, I used to have. Okay, they're actually... It's actually kind of like old card packs that they've actually released before, in a way. I remember the uh, Seahorse dude all too well, because when I got it, uh, it was like hologram. So I was actually pretty excited that it was. That it was. Alright, let's look inside of here again. You gotta show up for me, thank you. I remember Sonic Bird. Let's go ahead and open a pack, guys. Let's try and get our blue eyes. No, why not? We can open packs. Sadly, I remember this card. I believe there's an upgraded version of her, right? Or was it like a lower version? I remember there being like two cards of that. I remember you. Each sent to the graveyard. Oh my god. I I don't think I've ever read your skill. That is retarded. All face up monsters on the field turn to uh, defense. Alright, that's actually pretty decent. Now let's see how the deck editor is. This is Card Studio. What is around here? Alright, deck editor, card catalog, customize. Can you just like customize the back of it? I don't think I have any of those. Not yet. You can convert cards. What do you mean by that? Is it like a uh, crafting? Okay, so you need uh, actual gold? It's probably like a different currency to actually craft those. What about deck editor? What's in here? Alright, Kaiba has his own. Joey has his own. 
Let's look at Kaipas. Uh, 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 God. Such crappy cards. You can auto create if you wanted to. Was that Baby Dragon? No way I just saw Baby Dragon. There he is. Now all I need is the time dude and the actual card to make the um, Utter Dragon. So I only have a few little cards right now, so gotta keep that in mind. God, I want to dual hollow so much now. <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and take out this card. I don't want this card in here. Um, how does one do that? I want to take you out somehow. How, how does one take out this card? Guys, I'm triggered. Okay. Well, this is, this is gonna be... Okay, what if I just... Okay, I, I think I know how to do it. Sadly, I was hoping you can, like, drag him out, but apparently you cannot do that. So, I'm guessing you have to come over here and remove. Or was it just on the side? Yep. I'm blind. Don't judge me. <laughs> hey, you have a few issues when you come into a game like this. Add... Uh... Battle Hero... Battle Warrior. I don't think I want the superhero deck. I never was a fan of those. But let's go with some other cards. Uh, what else? We can add this one. Let's go ahead and add that one. Uh, what else can we add to our deck? We do have red eyes. But I don't want too many, um, like, high stars. Because if I get those, it's just going to be some trouble. Uh, I need a couple defense cards, too. Because it seems mostly that they added in attack cards into the deck. Alright, let's just go with this deck. And it's... I'm just going to save it right there. But, guys, that's pretty much how you edit your cards and everything. Joey has his own deck as well. Let's see what Joey had. So this is pretty much Joey's deck right here. But I'm pretty sure he didn't summon any of these. So, yeah. You can mix and match your deck and everything. Uh, what is this one? So, you can post your decks. And you can look at everybody's um, different cards. Okay, that's actually pretty dope. That's actually pretty dope. You can actually comment on them, too. And view others. What is this? This has been sitting at 7 for quite a while. Pre-register... Oh my god. Okay, so this is pretty much... Everyone who pre-registered. Let's go ahead and take all these. So meaning, I have a crap ton of card... Um, gems right now. Let's see, how many is it for um, 10 packs? That's what we'll do before we end it off. Oh, yes. Let's do this, guys. Just one of it to end the video. Go my way, Karibo. I just want to see what I get. Snake hair, pretty decent. I I'll take that. So one card from your hand to the graveyard. Change the battle phase. Well, battle positions of all monsters. Okay, okay. There it is. That's what I was talking about. I knew there was two different ones. It's sad because I remember these early card packs. Discard one card from your hand. No trap cards can be activated until the end of the turn. If this card is normal or flip summoned, its original attack and defense is halved until the end of your turn. After that, the turn is double. Oh my god, okay, it's doubled as it... Wait. Is the attack like double as it goes back to an original attack? Or does it like double twice to the original, then just add a little bit more? That's, that's kind of... Eh, I don't know about that. Original attack of your opponent's monster that battles this card during its turn 
becomes uh, 200 points during. The okay, yeah, that's that's actually okay. Oh, hey, Karibos, what's up? Up? Oh, is this a special pack? Is this it? I remember this. Elemental cards. I'll read that. I'll read these cards later. I'm just gonna show them off because we're actually extending our time right now. I'll, I'll read some of them to myself though. <laughs> I'm just gonna save the long ones to read them later. Attack this card increases by. Okay, that's good. Why do I think I remember this card? I remember this card being like so creepy. Destroy all monsters in your opponent's hand to control defense less than the greater to the that. Up oh, another special one? What's in here? Or maybe it's not special. Why are you guys misleading me? I remember this card. I remember it looking so goofy. I remember you. I think I had all the charmers. I believe I did have all the charmers. We already read you. During your opponent's standby phase, send one card from your well, going card from the top of their deck to the grave. Okay, noted, noted, noted. Sorry if I'm not reading these. I just really want to get through these card packs. Destroy all spells and traps on this on your side of the field. Increase your HP for each number. Destroy. Okay, okay, that's actually pretty good. Pretty good. I wonder, did I kind of wonder? Do some of these cards actually show the actual animations? I hope. I really hope they're working on the game that shows actual animations of the cards and what happens. Cause I remember um, in like the anime they used to have like the slot machine that did actual um, that did like actual uh, numbers and everything. I really hope they actually do that for actual VR Yu-Gi-Oh game. I would actually play that play that game every day. <laughs> Decrease what selected uh, monsters defense by 500. All right, that's actually pretty dope. Tornado. Am I thinking of a different tornado? Because I remember one that just destroyed all spell cards. This one's probably different. I remember this card. But that only equips the darts. Hello Karibos, something special? No? It's not gonna glow for me again? I've already seen that one. I've seen this one before. Pay 100 life points, select one ritual monster from your graveyard, special summon it, and equip it with this card. When this card is destroyed, remove, remove it from the... Oh god, it removes from play, okay. I remember this card as well. Got another one of those. Discard one card from your hand. Decrease the attack and defense of all monsters on your opponent's side of the field by 500 until the end of this turn. Alright, that's actually pretty decent. I actually like that card. <laughs> Blade Fly. As long as this card remains face up on the field, increase all wind monsters by 500. And decrease all attack to all earth monsters by 400. Alright. Pretty decent. If I was going to make a wind deck. If a monster is equipped with this card, it inflicts battle damage to your opponent. The damage becomes 1000. Oh, I remember this. I remember the little crab turtle. Oh yeah, I already, I already got a card for you too. So that's good. But here's pretty much all the cards I summoned. Good thing everything is new, so I'll go back and read them. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The game is actually pretty dope. Though it's actually kind of different from the, the other Yu-Gi-Oh games that they have made. I'm actually happy that they actually went for a mobile game. Oh, I can actually PvP now. 
That's dope. But, ho really hope you guys enjoyed. And you guys can try out the game for yourself. I'm probably gonna see if I can help Hollow fix his game and I can duel with him like later on. Or get him to download this emulator and he can play it on there. But until then, I will see you guys next time. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Peace out.